Hello, hello, Internet. Pike here. How are you doing? Um, tomorrow is the big day. The new release is coming. It's not going to be an expansion. It's going to be a new adventure, as far as I understood it. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're going to get a new adventure. It's going to go here, between Practice and League of Explorers. So, uh, yeah, adventure number four is going to come very soon. Uh, less than 24 hours, I guess. It should be released on the 11th of August. Uh, on my clock, it is four minutes past midnight, so it is the 11th of August. But I guess they're going to do it uh, according to American time, so between six and nine hours from now. It's going to be very interesting. Uh, already been a great upheaval on the internet because of Priest, which is, at the moment, the worst class ever, which is too bad. Um, I mean, I, I've never been a particularly a fan of Priest. I'm more of a rogue mage type of person, uh, warlock too, um, but... Um, Class is okay, but it's not been doing too well of late. Uh, I've seen a few dragon priests which are still doing fine on ladder, but yeah, it's, if, if you don't get that dragon synergy rolling, they just lose the hell. Uh, and uh, the, the new adventure has 40-something new cards, and uh, one of them is Purify, which is a two-mana card that silences one of your very own minions, so a friendly minion, and allows you to draw a card. And that's like the most terrible card ever. So it's not really doing anything for a class that's already fighting hard for survival. Uh, yeah. Don't know what they're thinking. Um, as far as I know, last thing I heard is that... Um, from Blizzard was that yes okay they they heard the outcry they took another look and yeah cards really not that good and uh, it's a terrible wreck so what they seemingly what they're going to do is they're going to make sure that you can't draw this card in arena because it would uh, obviously uh, wreck arena for priest totally nobody would ever play not that anybody's playing it right now I mean, I've been playing a few arena runs uh, of late, and I, I haven't run into a single priest. Mm. It's all mages, rogues, paladins, and warlocks and druids. You see an occasional shaman. Uh, and, and warrior. Warrior, too. Um, but, but priest? Uh, no. Never. But anyway, I'm not going to spend any money on Arena right now because I really want to finish Black Rock Mountain, so I'm saving up my my gold. But there's a new tavern wall. And I thought we could maybe check it out. So let's pick a class that I usually don't pick. I still have um I have several quests. One of them is uh play five uh, win five tavern brawls and the other one is win two games with druid uh, or hunter so I think I'm gonna play druid or hunter um, let's try hunter huh? I'm more of a tempo guy and druid's more like a mid tempo uh, deck mid range deck um I really like Druid. I like the hero Rexa power. Versus Valera. Watch your back. Let the hunt begin. Okay. Um. Damn. All three cards suck. Really. That's not a good beginning. What kind of deck are you giving me? Princess Uram. It's a legendary triggers a friendly minions death Job battle. Done. Do not fear death, hero. Your minions are useful to you both alive and dead. Keep trade. <sighs> K. 
Okay. What was that all about? Hmm. I actually... St <laughs> um... I'm actually not so sure. I read the description, and the description just says, yeah, yeah, just choose a deck. You don't have to create a deck. Just choose a class. We'll give you a deck. And then you'll play, and something old godly will happen. But not a very clear description of what, so... Not sure. Let's just play and see what happens. Trade your minions aggressively. Most of them give you an advantage when they are killed, so sacrifice away. I love sacrificing minutes, but I can't. Don't have anything on the board, so I can play Forlorn Stalker. Battle cry. Give all death rattle minions in your hand. Plus one, plus one. Do I have any? No, I don't. I hunt alone. So that's too bad, but. I think that's better, and then we'll play the Tomb Spider. My eyes are open. So discover a beast. Wow, that's bad, really. Okay, let's think, because I, I. I'm trying to get rid of uh, playing instinctively. I need to think more. So, Crab, uh, is he going to have Murlocs? I don't think so. Carrion Grub, 3 mana to 5. It's not bad. Whenever you summon a beast, draw a card. 3 2 is abysmal stats for 5. But of course, the, the card drawing mechanic is pretty good, but he's got a 3 3 here. <laughs> Uh, but I don't have a five. Yes, I have a five drop. I'll take the carrot drop. Quickly. I hunt alone. Get rid of that. Quickly. So I'm down to 23. Haven't sacrificed a minion yet. Only a weapon. Eagle horn bow. I've got two of them. But okay, I got the board. Hey, hey. Do you want to buy a funnel cake? I, I don't want to buy a funnel cake. <laughs> okay. Ooh, I've got Sylvanas in this deck. Wow. Hmm. Five minutes. So he just got a spell from me because I killed his minion or what? What's going on here? Ha, <laughs> this guy's toast. Well, my minion is dead. Why didn't I get anything? What? <laughs> This doesn't make any sense. Huh. <sighs> I didn't get anything for that. Not sure what's going on here, actually. What does this trade aggressively? I'm supposed to trade aggressively in order to make what happen. So far, this is just a standard game, actually. Hmm. Death rattle. Dagger, he's playing dagger, he's playing weapon, he's boosting it. Betray me. Okay, good. 
so now I got a secret. So now I can play the weapon. So I'm supposed to trade aggressively, but on the other hand, I want to keep the damage. I hunt alone. So, and if that secret gets um, revealed, then I get plus one durability, which means I can't attack this round with the weapon. Which, of course, he knows. Unless, of course, he plays a minion with charge. I wonder. Well, I don't think so. He's gonna play one with Tonda, I was just about to say, because he... Well, what a bad situation here. Now, I could get him down to six. But I'd rather have the board back. So now I've given him a clear hint, of course, what kind of secret that is. Thank you. So many wonderful poisons. I have no time for games. Could do that. Mm. I wonder. Or I could play the hounds if I. Um, if I actually want this one. But he's not gonna do that, right? Rise, quickly. Uh, Good. I of course went face with this. Because I want a minion, so he has to try and play with this. In order to leave nothing. This document looks legally binding. Oh, Twilight Summoner. That's pretty bad. But, on the other hand... Go ahead and attack me. It's all fine and dandy. What is this tavern brawl about? I, I, I haven't figured it out. Nothing seems unusual so far to me. Unless, of course, the brawl's broken. And they forgot the effect. And I, I do have the feeling that... Bye-bye, need to play it again. Sorry about that. Ooh. Not 
Not bad, he's got an Enzoff. Unfortunately for you, my friend, this is a beast. Which totally means that... Alone. Totally means that he has a taunt there. Which doesn't really matter. But okay. Bye bye. Ah! Au revoir. So what was the big thing about? I don't know. I didn't see any. Oh. Wow. A dark recipe. Care for a taste of the old god's power. Pick a class and we'll give you a taste of the old god's recipe for that class to do battle. Well, they told me to trade aggressively. I did. And nothing happened. It was just like any other game with Hunter. What's this all about? I don't know. First they fuck up the new adventure, which is not even out yet. Because they include great cards for those classes which are already at the top of the ladder. Best classes at the moment, in arena and in constructed. And add the worst card ever to the weakest class at the moment. I mean, they already have problems with their hero powers. Like, uh, Shaman has, because it's randomness. And Priest has as well, though I sometimes... Well, Warrior... Actually, I think the Warrior hero class is worse. Because it basically is a heal. You get two life back or you get two shield back. <laughs> But warriors can only do it onto themselves. They can't do it on minions. Well, at least priests can heal minions too, if need be. However, warrior has great cards. Priest, not so much. All right, let's open that pack. And then, I dare say, I'll go to bed. And I don't know what you're going to do. Here's the rare. Oh, two. Well, two at least. What we got here? Epic. Shadow form. Your hero power becomes deal two damage. It's a priest card. <laughs> uh. Oh, another rogue agent. I already have two, but thank you. Uh, I think the, the problem with priest is also that you... Um, the... Uh, Classic cards for Priest are already not that great. And then Priest went off in all kinds of directions, like damage Priest, you, you, you morph your hero power, or silence Priest, or, or, or uh, you steal minions from others, or, or maybe you have Dragon Synergy. And it, Normally it's good if you have lots of options, but none of them in Priest, I always have the feeling that none of them work really well. I mean, I, I on a, in arena, you never see priest at the moment, like never. It's all it's warrior, it's mage, it's rogue. Um, yeah, it's basically you see a few druids, sh you see a few warlocks, you see a little bit of shaman, uh, but priest, uh, no. And on ladder, well, I've seen a few dragon priests now and then, but. If they have the dragon synergy rolling, like ba basically, if they have a fairy dragon uh, or on in their hand and they can then do the synergy or what, yeah, they can get. If they start rolling, it's pretty bad. But chances are, they don't have the the necessary combos, and then pff, no, not a chance. Too bad. But hey. Um, from what I heard, um, Blizzard's actually announced a solution. It's not really a solution. All they said was, yeah, okay, we, we get it. The card's really going to wreck Priest in Arena. Because um, instead of getting a somewhat decent class card, you'll get Purify. And then your 
fucked. So they're going to make sure that purify this this card. Yeah, you can't choose an arena. But yeah, is okay. So so you're going to make sure that the class doesn't get any worse in arena, and people can still play what they have right now uh, on ladder. But that doesn't make priest any better, right? Doesn't really improve the the already worst class there is at the moment. I mean, I do understand they can't now willy nilly create a new great power card and put it into that adventure that is being released in a few hours. So yeah, but I hope that the next expansion will really do something for priests. I mean, I don't have a priest deck. I don't. I've got rogue deck, a uh, pirate rogue. I've got a mech mage. I've got um uh, well, I don't know how to describe explorer blast. It's just like Lots of fast spell damage. Uh, I've got this rogue deck that plays around with the, uh, the the coin mechanic. I got a classic zoo deck. I came up with it myself, but right now when I'm I'm playing uh, I'm playing a lot of warlocks, uh, especially on ladder, which actually play kind of this deck. So it's, I play I play mage. Hide mage is. Uh, also an idea that I came up myself, which basically you hide behind taunts and you have lots of removal spells and then you you get your opponent basically down to 20 or so and then you, you trigger the combo uh, Ronin and then uh, Archmage Antonidas and the three fireballs. Uh, this is Warlock playing around with um, Leroy Jenkins and uh, Power of Whelming. Then I have a, a, a Murloc uh, Paladin deck. This is I tried I tried to make um, an old gods deck, but I've still not finished. I don't know. I don't have really any idea how to finish it. Then I, I came up with this. I saw this card Xeril and came up with a poison idea of like how to use poison and damage spells, and I uh, I came up with the idea of um, combining this with uh, spell damage and then of course I had to put Malagos in there because uh, first of all it's a legendary I have and then of course there's nothing that boosts uh, damage direct damage spells better so this deck is basically pretty good keeping keeping everything under control until you have this combo uh, at hand and I really like to play that. I like to play decks where you don't just rush out tempo, but where you try to keep everything in check until you've got everything right for that grand strike. I've got a classic shaman deck, I guess, where I was just playing around with um, um, all the cards that shaman has. Um, it's nothing unusual. Same with, with druid. I did those two basically for because I I had quests like win two games with druid or with shaman or and I tried but yeah and then I I it's, it's what I'm playing around with at the moment I had an idea with uh, th there's a card that warrior has it's called bolster and everybody says it's totally bad um but give your taunt minions plus two plus two. What if your board is completely full of taunt minions? I mean, if you can combine it with things like the Obsidian Destroyer, you have like scarabs all over the place. Or so I try to create a deck that, which has a lot of taunt minions, um, but it's it, it it's w kind of working, but uh, the win rate's not too great. Um, 50% max a little bit higher but yeah it's not it's not running smoothly but as you can see there's no priest deck I mean I even have a warrior deck at the moment but there's no priest deck there's no priest deck and there's no hunter uh, I don't know hunters I don't find that too challenging you just rush to the face and sometimes you make it sometimes you don't 
Um, yeah, I'm, I'm quite sure there are possibilities with Hunter. I don't see that many possibilities. I tried with Priest. I really tried for a while. But not at the moment, I fear. All right. So much for my rant. Pike is signing off. Bye-bye.